<laughs> Ideas happen while I'm working. And oftentimes in my studio, I like to start 10 different things all in the span of a day when I'm just free and not working on any specific projects. Because there's so much potential in those starts and just the act of starting this new piece all these new feelings come into me, give me inspiration for something next to, to stab into. When I start off with something that I have no prescribed agenda for, it's almost easier to face the blank page because I could start off with a mistake straight away. I could start off with a scribble. I could start off with a color, let it develop from there. And as long as I try to keep myself open, the results usually find themselves. Whereas if I'm wanting something, wanting to make it good, wanting to make something that has some sort of profundity to it, that's when I usually get stymied up and, and do things that feel forced or contrived. For me, the purpose of art is, is, is a coping mechanism. For me, art has been something that, that allows me, allows me to, to be alive, allows me to function in the world, um, allows me to, to maintain some sort of equilibrium and to have a place to express myself that isn't, doesn't need me to be anything other than what I am in my perfectly mistaken form. You know, I just, I'm just such a believer artistically in a non-linear process. You know, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not interested in somebody, an artist sort of giving us all the info. I'm not so interested in pop songs. I'm more interested in someone's deep personal conversation with themselves and as an artist that I get to then witness. You know, no amount of talent can match determination. You have to be talented and determined. As an artist myself, I'm really striving to find something like the ways I worked or the mindset of who I was when I was in my early 20s. 20 years ago because there was something so essential and important about having all of this desire and need to express myself and not really having any established means to do so and so casting out in these really rough and raw ways to try to accomplish that. I'm Jason Yeagle. I live in San Francisco, California with my lovely wife and two daughters. I've been living here for 25 years. I grew up in Boston, Massachusetts. Uh, I'm a painter.